So if you would like to experience the games where Mario and Donkey Kong went 3D for the first time, then you would have to find yourself in Nintendo 64. Or you can experience the glory days a better way, that being through emulation. So in this video, I'm going to share what I consider to be the best 5 N64 emulators available for PC. Kicking things off at number 5 is an emulator called 1964. Now, the reason this emulator comes in at number 5, even though it is a decent emulator, is because sometimes it will crash during gameplay. It's rare, but it does happen. Now one of the coolest features this emulator has to offer is that you can customize ROMs once you have uploaded them, meaning you can make your own adjustments to games and add cheat codes. Number 4 is Simple64, and just like its name, the emulator is super simple to set up with no plugins to download. The emulator is basically a modified version of Moopin64, another N64 emulator that may have made this list. Something that I really like about this emulator is that it has netplay and the server is hosted in the cloud. Also, the compatibility list looks really good on this emulator. Number three is the one-stop shop, that being RetroArch. As I always mention in every video for people new to emulation, setting this emulator up is not quick or simple. That is, unless you follow my RetroArch setup guide, link in the description below. Anyways, I will say once you do have this emulator set up, it basically gives you the best settings and maps your controller out for you if it's compatible. Taking the number two spot is Moopin64 Plus. First off, the emulator has a great compatibility list and plays games with a smooth frame rate. There are also quite a few good features available on here as well. Moopin64 Plus serves as a base core to some other 64 emulators because it's open source. So you or anybody can play around with this emulator or take code from the emulator and do what you want freely. And my number one pick is Project 64. This emulator works perfect and has a lot of features to play around with. Even with all the features, it's still not a complicated emulator to set up and run because mostly everything is set up by default. You have the ability to enter cheats, there is full multiplayer, play full screen, and this is just a few features, there's quite a bit more. So if you want the best experience and you wanna feel like you're actually playing a 64 that's been upgraded, then this is it. So those are the top 5 emulators that I choose to use for N64 emulation. Thanks for watching, I hope this video was helpful, if it was, make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already, and I will catch you guys in the next one. Peace.